What's the difference between granite and quartz? In this video, you're gonna find out. Welcome back everyone. I'm Joshua Brees with Surprise Granite. When it comes to countertops, do you find it difficult deciding between granite and quartz? Although quartz is gaining in popularity, the leader has always been granite countertops and it's much more prevalent in kitchens than quartz is today. Because granite is quarried up out of the ground and then sliced into smaller slabs or pieces, no two pieces ever really going to be the same. So it's extremely important that you go to the warehouse or to the yard like MSI or Eric Cruz and pick the actual slab that we will get to use inside of your home. If you were to try and pick out a piece of granite just simply based off of the sample that we bring out to your home, it may show up completely different than what it looks like on the full slab. So it's really good idea to go out there and actually pick the slab that you would like to use for your new kitchen countertops. Now granite does require a sealer and it's recommended for most granite that you seal it at least once a year. There are some sealers out there that offer warranties for up to 15 years. Obviously, there would be some type of cost associated with them, just to give you a heads up. Speaking of cost, granite is priced in levels. It starts at a level one, two, or three, and then goes up from there. Some warehouses are going to have it labeled as A, B, or C. As you move up, so does the price. Now let's move over to quartz. Quartz is a man-made product. It's about 90 to 93% quartz crushed up and then mixed with seven to 10% resin and different binders. Because of this, quartz is very dense and non-porous. So you don't have to worry about sealing it like you do with granite. Some of the other advantages to it being man-made is that it's very uniform. So you're able to make your selection just based off of a tiny sample. That uniformity also lends itself better to tight seams that are less noticeable. Because of the randomness of granite, sometimes its seams can be quite obvious. Quartz is just as heavy, but a little bit more flexible than granite. So it's less likely to break upon installation. From a cost perspective, the entry level for quartz is just a little higher than granite. So the lowest level quartz could be above the lowest level of granite. However, the cost of the two minerals is so close together that most of the people make their choice based purely on aesthetics. A lot of the times the quartz lends itself better to a more contemporary look and design because of the uniformity of the material. When deciding between these two products, you really can't make a bad decision because they both look great as countertops. If this video helped you in any way, go ahead and hit the like button. Leave us a comment and subscribe to our channel. See you next time.